April Sycamore, happy Thursday, and happy last day of our school week. Today is April 6, 2023, and welcome to this episode of For Daily Video Announcements. I'm Kim. And hello, I'm Eli. We're so excited to be here with you all on, on the Daily Video Announcements. Now let's please stand, place our hand over our heart, and honor this amazing country as we say the Pledge of Allegiance together. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you all. Please be seated. Remember, if you see something, say something. Please report any suspicious behavior to a staff member or administrator. Check your work and school emails throughout the day as we finish strong this last quarter. Make the right decisions, and as always, the PBIS responsible young adults. Be safe, be respectful, and be problem solvers. All right, check and mark your calendars for our school events. We're two school days away from air testing. If you haven't already, during Flexbell today, your teacher wants to direct you to shut off your Chromebook completely off so it can update for air testing, which starts next Tuesday, 4-11. If you're absent on Friday, your teacher will have you do the restart on Monday. Get good sleep and make sure you do good practice for the air testing days coming up next Tuesday, April 11th, and Wednesday, April 12th, for the ELA air testing and math air testing is the following week. This is on April 19th and 20th. Then 7th graders are done, and 8th graders will finish up their science air test on Tuesday, April 20th. I'm so sorry we didn't announce this sooner, but happy Ramadan. Many of our Muslim friends have started fasting them two weeks ago. This means eating before sunrise and fasting until sunset. No water, no food. Wow, that's crazy. Also, happy Passover. Passover is a major Jewish holiday that celebrates the biblical story of the Israelites' escape from slavery in Egypt. Also, Good Friday is tomorrow. Enjoy the day off. Good Friday is a Christian holiday commemorating the crucifixion of Jesus and his death at Calvary. It is observed during the Holy Week as part of the Paschal Triduum. It is also known as Holy Friday, Great Friday, Great and Holy Friday, and Black Friday. Next up, did you know? Did you know sharks love the taste of the internet? It was reported by the New York Times that sharks have shown an inexplicable taste for the new fiber optic cables that are being strung around the ocean floor linking the United States, Europe, and Japan. Wow. So they eat the internet? Apparently. Apparently. Next up, National, National Day. Day. Today is National Food Faces Day. It's a nice excuse to play with your food. I can't wait to see what faces everyone comes up with. Angry? Sad? Who knows? Next up, Evan's Survey of the Week. Hello, my name is Evan and welcome to, weekly, to the Weekly Survey. The results of this week's survey of cats or dogs was dogs won with 69.4% and cats lost with 38.6%. Next week's survey will be mint gum or fruit flavored gum. Thanks, Evan. Next up, birthdays! Happy birthday to Annalise B, Cameron S, Isaac M, Colin M, Kendall A, Grady S, all celebrating today. And happy birthday to those celebrating over the weekend, starting with Ella W, William M, Casey M, Palace F, as well as Robert S, Dia S, and wonderful Mrs. George celebrating Saturday. And celebrating Sunday is Gavin C, Hader A, Cecil S, enjoy celebrating you. Now over to Mr. Harris. Good afternoon, Sycamore Junior High, and welcome to your daily video announcements. This is just a reminder for all 7th grade students, all CAR forms, that's course adjustment request forms, must be turned in no later than Monday. That's Monday, April 10th. If you have this or any other questions regarding your classes for next year, please email your counselor. Remember, if you'd like to go on the Partners Club field trip, you need to get your permission slip and $20 to Mrs. Serbliss by April 14th. If you need a new permission slip, uh, or you have any other questions, please email Mrs. Serbliss or see her in room 103. And this is the last day we'll make this announcement. All second quarter straight A students, if you earned straight A's during second quarter and received an email regarding Cincinnati Reds straight A ticket program, please see Mrs. Manning in the counseling office today, today to claim your ticket voucher. After the day, you can't get them anymore. All right, that's it. You guys have a great day. Remember, we'll be testing next week. All right, so make sure you get plenty of rest and all those other things. Also today, if you didn't do it during FlexBell, make sure you restart your Chromebook so it's updated for testing. Thank you guys, and have a great day and a great three-day weekend. Thanks, Mr. Harris.
Hello everyone, Sam here with our new updated Pop Tab results. So moving on to quarterfinals, we have in Hinson and Gates versus Mrs. Diorio's class. We have Foley and Craver versus Mrs. Jarvis and Mrs. Milligan. Then we have uh, Reinhardt versus Spielman and Stein and Sagers versus Miles and Andriola. Notice there is a change. Miles will be with Andriola instead of Tepfer and Andriola. And the teams that were eliminated were Callahan and Wolf, Harrison Hammer, Darby Shire, Huffman and Dworkin, Schaff and Reinhardt, Reese, and Swenson and Alleman, and um, Meyer and James. Those teams were eliminated. So um, if next week we'll be collecting on Wednesday, 3 p.m. as usual, and then the winning teams will move on to semifinals, then we'll have finals. And uh, Final Four do get a special prize, um, along with Top 2 and the Top. So try to make it to Final Four and collect those pop tabs, Sycamore. Bye. And now over to Mr. Harris with our Students and Athletes of the Week. Time to present this week's Students of the Week. So our first Student of the Week is Aiden Kaler. Aiden, come on over. Aiden was nominated by Mr. Heil, and again, all of these students were nominated for being safe, for being responsible, being problem solvers, and being respectful. So Aiden, there's your Thank you. certificate. Chick-fil-A, there you go. <laughs> all right, our next student of the week is Studi Kalagi. All right, Studi was nominated by Mrs. Henson, all right, for being safe, being responsible, being a problem solver, and being respectful. All right, so there's your certificate, and she already has her Chick-fil-A. You're welcome. And last, but certainly not least, we have Naomi Brocksterman. And Naomi was nominated by Mrs. Ramatka. So all of our students of the weeks were nominated for being safe, for being responsible, being a problem solver, and being respectful. Give it up for our students of the week. <laughs> Congratulations. There is that. And thanks, Chick-fil-A, for sponsoring those, too. All right, last but not least, I'd like to honor this week's Athlete of the Week. So if you would come on over, we have Rosa Lloyd. All right, and Rosa is a member of the girls lacrosse team. Yep. All right, and she's a seventh grader. She's a rookie player this year, and but her consistency to embrace new challenges is continually applauded by her coaches. Um, once she steps on the f steps foot on the field every day, she's ready to push herself and her teammates and improve their skills and showing fortitude in a brand new setting. Her knowledge of basketball, and I always say this about a lacrosse, okay, has transferred well, and she finds herself a strong part of our defensive squad, shutting off many would-be attacks so far this season. She's a tough matchup, and off the field she's kind, funny, smart, and a welcome addition to the team. Say something funny. No, I'm good. Okay, she's good. All right. No, I'm sorry. I did that to her. I apologize. All right. Congratulations, Rosa. There's your write-up, and there's your certificate. So give it up for our athlete of the week. Yeah, Rosa! All right, that's it. Back to you. Congratulations. Now it's time for joke of the day. Why should you write with a broken pencil? I don't know. Why? Because it's pointless. <laughs> <laughs> be the best extraordinary you that you can be, Sycamore, and follow PBS expectations every day. And for goodness sake, have a wonderful week. Get rest, eat well, and go, go Waves! waves!